Chemistry and Biochemistry is a medium-sized program. We have a graduate student to research faculty ratio of about four to one. The individual students get a lot of attention from their mentors. What that means for the students is that they, it's conducive to learning, first of all, but they also don't get lost in the program as we move along. So they tend to finish in about five years, and during that time they get uh, a competitive stipend as well as free tuition. So essentially students can come and get an advanced degree in chemistry or biochemistry and leave with little or no cost to themselves. We have uh, programs in organic chemistry, in biochemistry, in analytical chemistry, in physical chemistry, and in inorganic chemistry. In recent years, we, we purchased a whole slew of new uh, NMRs, and, and so we have the, the, the best and greatest, essentially, NMRs that one can buy at this point in time and, and have staff to help you use them. So students get to make these molecules and then go interrogate them, for example, using these instruments. A similar situation with mass specs as well. So uh, we have a, a number of people that are trained to help you get your research done. In my case, in my specific field, I'm able to synthesize new compounds that have never been seen before. So I have that sudden fulfillment when something works correctly or something actually is producing something new that I did something no one else has done yet. A PhD itself can be very demanding and mentally challenging. So it's important to find a place where you feel belong. Um, as an international student, being far away from home, um, Bell has become a second home to me. Whenever I was coming to tour Baylor during the AIW workshop and during grad recruitment weekend, the entire faculty was quite pleasant and they provided us with various um, scenarios around the department where we could go and attend different research labs and kind of get a look at what's going on here. That kind of is a step beyond most universities because you actually see the lab itself and see what they're actually doing. It can take part in a small amount of that, the way you can see if this is the right fit for you or if you actually are interested in the university itself. Other than being in the lab all the time, we do take classes and do interact with a lot of the professors. Uh, with my PI himself, uh, he's constantly coming in and out of the lab, so we see him all the time. We chat, not only about research, but pretty much about everyday things as well. I've seen that uh, this professor is working hard to create a safe environment uh, for the students where our input is uh, acknowledged, where we don't have to compete against each other, but we can work together as a team to reach the same goal and publish in uh, competitive journals. We're trying to reshape the sciences here at Baylor and uh, get, a, get a place at the table on the national scene. Uh, I really do think that, that in the next decade or so, our program is gonna be uh, growing in leaps and bounds. And it's really moving into areas that we've not been in before. Um, so I, I think our future is bright.